welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by for another video today we will be continuing the vlogs giving edition video for another awesome review today i will be reviewing some ted baker purchases that i purchased from amazon bye guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe share if you care hit that notification bell so you can be alerted every single time that i post but without further ado, let's jump right into the actual purchases that I purchased. So the first thing that I purchased is this Ted Baker bag. It obviously came in already in the dust bag. I really love this bag because it's black and gold and it's going to match pretty much all of my outfits for the winter time. So I really, really love that. So it has this gold chain very nice link it's a really sleek bag there is not a lot of i like this leather it's not like the really tough safiano leather this one is definitely a little bit more flexible and a little bit more bendable um and i also like that it has two sections it's almost like two clutches combined together as you can see this little magnetic strip that holds it down and it has like the black lining of ted baker i actually love that they paid attention to detail on the inside as you can see, it has that gold lining on the actual pocket area. Um, and it also has that on the actual other one too as well, if you can see that. It also comes with a crossbody strap. As you guys know, if you've watched any of my other unboxing of like Kate Spade, I don't really wear like these straps. It may look cute with this one, but I'm not really a fan of crossbody straps unless it is a true crossbody. I love that it has this really hard class, circle clasp hardware that holds onto this gold strap. So it's gonna make it very sturdy. So like if I throw a lot of things in here, it's gonna stay put, it's not going to drag the bag down. So I do like the construction of the bag overall. But yeah guys. That is this Ted Baker purse. I absolutely love it. I'm really excited about pairing this with some looks, especially for my birthday coming up. But guys, let's go ahead into the next purchase. The next thing I have is just a little cute uh, rose pink makeup bag that I got to as well. Um, and I actually really love this. If you guys see my other review, it's kind of like the shoes. I really love bows and hearts and things like that. Very girly and especially pink and rose gold. And this had like literally everything. So I think I am absolutely obsessed. Um, this is, will be something that I can throw into my Louis Vuitton bag and also something I can throw into this Ted Baker bag as well with my makeup and have it go for there. So um absolutely just love it it's very girly it has everything that you need um i think this one will be able to hold like obviously a simple small palette everything kind of small obviously you wouldn't be wanting to do full size anything in this one but like for your daily stuff so you know your setting spray anything a little small travel powder things like that it will be able to hold all of those things quite well and stick it into your purse so i really do love this item um, and I want to let you know what the price was on both the items. I think both of the items I looked at was on sale now after I bought them. I know I'm really pissed off about that. So I will be calling Amazon to get like that money back because you can still get it back um, within a month of purchasing. Um, but this one was $49 which is actually a good price for a really nice makeup bag. Even if you think about Victoria's Secrets, they cost about that price. Um, and the bag, the leather black and gold bag that I got from Ted Baker was $335. So together I spent about $400 for these purchases. Um, I think they're very cute staples, especially for winter fall. Um, obviously it's winter everywhere now, especially in Chicago, cause we have snow. But guys, thank you so much for watching my video today. Guys, thanks again. Bye.